curious what you don't see about investments in your business. You see your business growing in a linear way. It is increasing its revenue every month slowly and steadily. And then when you think about investment in your employees, coaching, or perhaps into Nufano, what happens is you see the money going down and you think that, hey, on the mi micro scale, the investment is not a good idea. But here is what you don't see on the macro scale. You don't see on the macro scale that if your investment doesn't pay off, that's fine because nothing changes and your business will get back to normal. Okay, this is what's going to happen on the macro scale. But if your investment pays off, what happens is that the steep of the curve changes. So the steep being this changes to this. Now you see the difference here. Now, what you don't see on the macro scale, if you invest, even though you see that you have less money for a short time, you don't see that you're leveling up and your steep is becoming much, much steeper every single time. And this is something that people just don't see on the macro scale. And this is why it is important to invest in coaches, in employees, in uh, new funnels development, because you don't see that on the macro scale, this actually makes a massive impact in your business and in your life. This is how you level up from making one to 2K per month to making 10 to 20. And this is also how you level up from make, making 10 to 20, 200 to 200. This is the first way that I visualize investment to people to understand why is it important for them to invest in those three aspects of their online business, especially when converting from freelancing to entrepreneurship. Employees, coaching, and funnels. The second way to visualize your decision making in the macro scale is understanding that today you can make a decision. Now you can make a poor decision and the poor decision will more likely create circumstances in your life that will attract another poor decision. For example, if you eat unhealthy food now, you're going to feel worse and you're going to make poor decision after, which will lead to, for example, making a worse poor decision, maybe not being sharp on the sales call and not closing a sale and therefore feeling down about yourself, feeling bad about yourself. And because you feel bad about yourself saying, hey, feel shitty, I'm just going to order pizza now to feel better about myself and eat chocolate. I just like food. <laughs> So this leads to a poor decision. Maybe you make poor decision in your relationship. You argue with your girlfriend or wife, and then you feel uh, angry, and then you feel less motivated uh, to work. So this is like a butterfly effect. The decision you make right now impacts the decision you will make in the future. It impacts the quality of decision you make in the future. On the other hand, with the butterfly effect, you could make a positive decision right now to do something smart. And let's say you eat something healthy and you get well rested. And for this reason, you close a sale. And because you feel more positive and you have more money in your bank account, you don't feel needy to eat and f fill this emotional gap, eat some junk food, you feel better. You're like eating something healthy, eat a salad, a steak, you feel great. You take your girlfriend or wife uh, for a date, you guys eat something healthy, and then you have money to reinvest into your relationship, whatever it is. Um, let's say a quick holiday, or at least you have time because you got the sale, so you're not stressing out. And those are just examples of how making your decision right now impacts your future. 
So don't make a poor decision right now because it will impact quality of your decisions in the future. It's like domino effect. Take action today. Make smart decision today. Take the best action you can today. And this is how your life actually changes. <laughs> Feel the life and feel our heart.